Hey Cinemark fans, Dave Spoli here with the cast and the director of the feel-good triumph that is the film Champions. Guys, this movie was so fun to watch and it really felt like, despite being probably a bit cold, that it was a lot of fun to work on. I wonder, how was your experience, Woody? Great, great experience. Uh, yeah, no, of course it was in a cold place, but uh, there was a lot of warmth between the the folks on this movie. Uh, I love working with Caitlin. I think she's a magnificent actress, and I uh, I had a lot of fun with her. She's Aww. she's hysterically funny, and then also she can really uh, you know she can na you. nail the uh, she can punch <laughs> a guy uh, when he's down. But no, she uh, all of the friends I really had the best time with. I I've, I was amazed by how good they were. Uh, because I didn't know what to expect, honestly, and uh, came they in. Had, they, a lot of them hadn't had very many acting jobs before. Yeah, mm. some some it was their first time yeah. acting, uh, but it was just terrific. And how about for you, Caitlin? It, it seemed like you had a lot of fun. You got to drive this fun RV and have all the friends back there. What was the experience like? I love an underdog story. I love this character was very dynamic to me. I, I loved that how funny she was, but also how vulnerable. Um, and how fiercely she loved and wanted to protect her brother. Um, and all of the actors who played the friends were just so, so much fun and so happy to show up to work every day and give it their best and ask questions and you would cut and we would be laughing and playing basketball, people would be making jokes, dancing. We just had the best time. It was a really good experience. You know the game better than anybody. We gotta defend over here! You got to learn to build relationships. I'm new to all this. Yeah, I can tell. Hey, we got next. Don't make me say it. Make you say what? There we go. Oh, that's a boo-boo word. We got next. What's your biggest takeaway from having worked on such a touching film? What you learn of, um, from this particular group of actors is how talented they were outside of what they were doing in the film. They had other talents, you know, they could, Marlon could speak uh, seven languages. Uh, uh, other pe uh, people were great uh, 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 musicians too. They could do that, workers, or they had other talents, you know, that they could exploit that you would never expect. You know? I couldn't, even, I wouldn't even expect them to play uh, basketball at, or be an actor. None of them had acted before. So there, there was that, like, oh God, well these guys are doing great. You know, because it's not easy. This was truly an ensemble comedy, and with all great ensemble comedies, it does come down to the casting. I wonder what that process was like finding these actors. What we did was we had an open casting call all, all over the U.S. and Canada. What we did, though, is we started with, with basketball teams, whether it's Special Olympic teams or rec league teams or best buddies or one of those organizations where disabled people are already playing basketball. And from that community, we had them all audition, and hundreds and hundreds of uh, auditions came in, and uh, we picked these 10 actors, and they, they all, we, we got the right ones, because they're all terrific. Yeah, they were slam dunks, pardon the pun. So folks, do not miss your chance to jump out of your seat and cheer for the friends in the film champions by getting your tickets at cinemark.com. I don't know if you're brave or crazy. Give me a hug, coach! But I know this is your shot at being champions. <laughs>